Welcome back everyone to the BD1P Binding of Isaac modded series. I know it's kind of weird not seeing my face on the screen. There's a reason for that though, so hang tight for that reasoning. But anyways, today is going to be an Azazel run for my final video before vacation for win number two and obviously episode number 326. The reason we're playing as Azazel today and only Azazel is because... I'm really tired. It's about like 10 p.m. here. See, by the way, is going to be KM9JQC36. I am very tired. It is like 10 p.m. and I leave tomorrow morning. Uh, that's a great start at the episode right there. Uh, and it's so dark outside right now that my green screen is not working properly, making me kind of think, you know what? We're going to recess back to the olden days of the Isaac streak. We're going we're gonna to go webcamless for today. Uh, not to, I'm very greasy also, by the way. Like, I, my hair is super greasy right now, so I don't really want to be on camera is the thing. But, uh, yeah, last video before vacation. It's, it's going to be interesting. Uh, it, I'm already kind of, like, taken aback. Eh, it's okay. By, like, not seeing my face on the screen with, like, it feels wrong. Like, can you guys hear me and, like, envision me talking without actually seeing me? Am I going crazy right now? I have no idea, man, but I don't care about anything in there. Uh, I've had a very, very <laughs> stressful evening, so I recorded the last video, and I edited that together, put it on YouTube, and I was kind of just sitting down. Waiting for my aunt to come over because she's watching our um, our cats while we're gone. And she's a bit late because she's kind of sick right now. But when she gets here, we kind of brief her on everything. We're like, okay, uh, you know, make sure that you give Zimmy her medicine. Like, the food's over here. All that kind of stuff. And um, we kind of had, like, an idea here. It doesn't... It, where is... Can this multi-tool thing find the secret room? You should be able to, I feel like. But we already kind of used... The multi-tool, so we probably can't find the secret room with it, I would doubt. Anyways, um, she has a great idea, because Zimmy, our cat, like, we think she'd be a very social animal if my other cat, Beauty, wasn't so mean to her. And the idea we had was, what if we introduced my aunt's dog and my kitty, uh, so that in the event that we get another animal, uh, that Zimmy or, or, like, would be more adjusted to being around other creatures that aren't just Beauty, constantly hissing and harassing her and i was like you know what that's a great idea why don't i bring the cat over and we can have the dog and the cat meet and see how zimmy would react around being with another animal that's not a mean animal like beauty is uh so we kind of get this whole shebang set up here uh, i i get the cat in her carrier I, I walk like the one minute over wow that was awful and uh Zimmy's like a little bit afraid of the walk. She's she's kind of meowing on the way. They're like, I don't want to be out here. It's super super hot outside, but it's it's like a one minute walk. She can live with it. Uh, and eventually, we make it. Ooh, that's pretty good. We make it to the uh, the that hit me. I gotta change the monstro hitboxes here, man. Dude, why is our damage already so insanely high? I guess that was ball of bandages in there doing a, a lot of my damage for me. But we arrive at the apartment and. My, my aunt's dog is a very tiny dog. Sure, we can take this. Uh, it's a very tiny dog, and she's very, like, playful and loves just to run around constantly, right? She's, she's a, a pretty average dog, to be honest with you. Huh? It's not there. We should probably save the multi-tool for if we can look for another... Why is this item showing up everywhere right now? Uh, it's, I'm not going to complain. It's a very, very good item. And it works really well as this character with the high damage we have, so I'm not going to complain, but still. Uh, the dog doesn't really notice that I'm holding a cat in my hand. Until I put the carrier on the floor, and I unzip, like, both sides of it. I wonder if we already used the multi-tool. I, I have no idea. I'm, I'm as lost as you guys are right now. And Zimmy's kind of like, she's not meowing, she's not, like, hissing. She's sitting in the carrier trying to inch away from, like, where the dog is trying to sniff her at. Ballot's good, but we can probably just buy a soul heart and be just as fine right now. And the dog is trying to sniff like Zimmy's butt because dogs like to get familiar that way, I guess. And Zimmy hates him. So I pick up Zimmy and I kind of, yeah, I guess I think it would be here or it's not there. Yeah, we can do this for sure. Uh, and Zimmy's not really enjoying this too much. Like I can tell she's a bit on edge. Uh, and then Zimmy starts hissing. And it's a lot louder than any other hiss of hers that I've heard before in the past. Uh, 
and I kind of go like, hey, no, and I, I stroke her back, and I kind of pull her a bit away, but she keeps wanting to go forward towards the dog and is still hissing uh, at the dog. And then she does something that I've never seen a cat do before. She starts growling. I didn't even know cats could growl besides, like, purring. It, it was a whole new world to me. But Zimmy starts growling um, at dog. But the dog, she, he, she, like, enjoys it. She's like, oh, we're just playing. We're having fun. And then Zimmy goes to, like, like you know, scratch her. So I pull Zimmy away, and I'm like, what the fuck is wrong? Get your head in the game. We were, we're on a mission right now. Uh, but Zimmy does not want to be there, so... I bring her to the bathroom, I kind of let her calm down, I put her back in her carrier, and we leave, and, uh, it kind of, like, sets in that, like, man, I wonder if this was all Beauty's fault. I wonder if, if the reason that, because Zimmy seems like a very, uh, what's, what's the word? Like, friendly animal. And I wonder if Beauty being so mean to her, or so, like, territorial towards her, has, like, shaped Zimmy into this mean fucking monster uh, of a, of a cat. And it's hard to see my baby go this route, but th them's the breaks, as the as uh, Boris Johnson would say. Them's the breaks. Get dodge that there, thank you. And it, it kind of said in here that like I'm gonna be away from my cats for a week. I have not been away from my cats for more than a day. Not it, it, actually, I have never been away from my my cats, even Beauty, for a day ever. Less than 24 hours is always the margin for me, and. I feel terrible because we have a kitty who needs to be like have a lot of attention and a, a more adult cat that is has really bad anxiety like I, I think the reason I'm, I'm like all concerned that's really good is because I, I have no way to I, I have no reason to do work on this trip I have all my work done ahead of time so work is not going to stress me out but I feel like I need is something to be stressing me out or is something like related to stress to think about when I'm on vacation. I, I feel like I've, I work around just stress and it's, it's a terrible thing. It's, it's really not good. That's bookworm. So buy that and put it back down. Uh, it, it, that's a really, what is that? Forgive me now, right? That's insane. Uh, I'm going to drop this out here and I'm going to black rune the Bible for stats so we don't waste it. Beautiful damage and luck. Two amazing stats right there. That I feel like not having to stress about work at all because everything is done to a, a good margin. Um, I'm going to be stressing about my cats the entire trip. And I, I'm kind of upset now because I wanted to have a good vacation, but my brain's telling me, hey, what about your very anxiety-ridden cat who's going to miss you half to death? Let's fucking go, dude. Praying altar. I'm going to go a little bit quicker here. Uh... So I, I, I hope it'll be okay. I, I know it will be okay for sure. That's okay. Uh, careful. I'm going to keep this full card until whatever final path we go to here. But I'm, I'm looking at Beauty right now. She's taking a sleep. And I'm like, my, my beautiful baby. My, my beautiful daughter. She's sick. Somebody help her. I, it, it, it's making me just nervous for no reason. Like, I know it's going to be okay. I trust my aunt with my cat's lives for sure. Uh... I just hate when animals feel sad, I guess. Like, I, because you can't, like, communicate to them. We've had this conversation on this, like, streak uh, hundreds of times over, but the reason animal emotions hit so hard is because, like, you can't explain what or why you're doing something, right? Like, an animal only understands their schedule. They don't really get that humans have work or have obligations to go to. They think our lives are like theirs. We can just sit around, you know, like, eating food all day and rolling a catnip all night that that's their idea of what life is unless they've obviously been like reincarnated or some shit like that i want to definitely do this actually but a lot of the time they're not going to understand what we're doing and it, it, it does break my heart to be like man i'm gonna leave and they're gonna think that i'm leaving them because like i want to i don't want to leave you like i want to i want to bring you with me but you're too anxious for that beauty i'm sorry same with like zimmy could totally handle being on a train she would love everybody there Zimmy is a very social cat with people. Uh, oh my god, hello, beautiful. Zimmy is a very social cat with people, but when it comes to, um, I guess, other animals, she's not so keen. What's the best way to introduce a kitty to be more social in that regard? If anybody in the comments knows, I would love to hear it. I, I really want my cats to be friends because it would make my life and I'm assuming their life a whole lot easier. Oh my god, we're getting so much stuff right now. Give me two items. They dropped me two items. I'm playing risky too. 
with this uh, this altar fiend. So we have brain worm. Not a a um range up, which most of those worms are, but not that guy. And it's over. That's okay. Keep on moving on here. But I wanted to do an Azazel right just so I can go a bit faster here today. Uh, and not be um having an hour run at, at like 10 p.m. I also have to do a couple of voice lines for a different video as well still. Uh, it, it's the very tail end of my work. I'm almost, almost done. And then we're home free. For you guys, tomorrow's episode will be back to normal. I will be back from vacation, uh, hanging around with you guys, having some good stories to tell. Oh, I have Mercurius. Speaking of going fast, I got pooped out of that room immediately there. But we can now go insanely fat. Why do I have a broken heart? Why do I have a broken heart? Ooh, a little bit of stopwatch action. Never hurt nobody. You're a slow altar fiend now. What gave me a broken heart, man? I don't have any, like, Mastema items doing that. I don't think. I have Blood Splosion, but that doesn't give you a broken heart. You know? I guess, I guess I'll just never know what caused that broken heart. But I, we're, we're going to live with it for now. I'm looking at my items right now. I see nothing that could have possibly caused that. We only just, like, immediately or recently got that, so... Ooh. I have no keys, is the thing. Isaac is sad, huh? I can make him. I can fix him. Yeah, you two items here? Yup. Okay, this is gonna be really, really good if we get a good pull here. Oh my god, another one? Okay. Uh, Daddy Long Legs. I don't really care for a lighter to be real with you. Give me give me another double. I was almost lucky. Last play. One more penny. A singular penny. I do want to get a key for our double item room as well. But I, Oh, there's a key in this ghost pal. Look at how good everything is turning out for us right now. No, nothing there. Okay. Oh, hey. Hey, Tech L. Uh, fancy uh, seeing you here. Do you even work? Why is my range so good? Oh, because I have... Wait, what? I, I don't know what caused that. Oh, I have $3 bill, you idiot. That, it does work, by the way. Tech L is giving us laser beams out of our brimstone thing, I think. Wow, no deal there. We're going for the hundo next floor, huh? Might be the floor you want to use the forget-me-now on then, so we can get it back and maybe get a second 100 chance, huh? Ever uh, think about that, liberals? I don't think so. Keep going. I hear the altar fiend. You're okay. You're fine. Don't clear it. You don't got to clear any rooms. You're fine. You can literally run through everything. If you guys like, by the way, the webcam being gone for whatever reason, please let me know. Because it, I guess, like, I like it, but it is it a bit easier to record. And I can do it uh, with less preparation, I guess, without the webcam. But I, I feel like it's, it's hard to watch my videos without me being on the screen. Uh, the only exception being, like, the video essays that I do. Those, you feel like you shouldn't have a webcam on the screen. Because, like, at that point, either A, your cam is not, like, synced up to your voice, or B, it doesn't need it doesn't need to be there. Whereas, like, videos styled like this, where it's just me podcasting, hello, sexy, um, there, there should be something there. Do you, I forget if this works or not. It does work. Okay. Pentacle's not the greatest item to see, but... Oh, can I grab it, though? There we go. Thank you. Um, let's go back and try to find our item. We're going to have a nice, really powerful run to finish off this, this segment of videos for me. I recorded seven videos today. In total, I recorded seven Isaac runs today. I, I knew you were there. Like That was just my own fault. That's crazy. I broke my record. And you can probably hear my from my voice that it was not a good idea to do that, but... Uh, the, as Boris Johnson would say, man, them's the breaks. Good old Prime Minister Magic going. I guess ex-Prime Minister Magic. Is, is that what they're called over there, Prime Minister? I don't know. Both active items? I sleep. I completely sleep. I could take Cursed Lamp and break my game wide open, uh, but not my, my vibe for today's run. Pop the card, do the floor over again for extra double items, and... Uh, keep things going just peachy here we do not get the full 100 percent chance i didn't expect to that's okay we do get a 21 and a 12 though uh so we get like a 33 percent chance again and an item room off the bat here goodbye uh what are you gonna have for me in here dodge give me give me a small rock to re-roll as well 
Hey, not really what I wanted to see. Oh my god, a foiled stars card and money equals power for like the sixth run in a row. I cannot turn him that down. Careful. That's exactly what I wanted to see. It's a proptosis right there. I do feel a bit weird though, like not like when I pause to, to breathe or just to kind of like focus on the game and you can't see my face focusing. What if you guys think I'm just like I leave. Like, I'm not here anymore. Like, I, just, I walked off the camera. <laughs> I wouldn't do that, but, like, it, it just, it's a change of pace. I gotta get used to it. I, I'm, I'm gonna try to have webcam back, you know, every other video, but why did, why am I so bad at this video game? It just, I, I'm, I'm so thrown off my groove by this. Ace of Spades. The Foiled Stars card with the Praying Altar is like a dream come true. Why would I ever give this up? Hey, we're going the right way. Like if, if I stop talking now, I'm gonna I'm gonna like be quiet for like 20 seconds, right? With me not being on the screen, does it make you uncomfortable? Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it. There we go. Here, I'm gonna go quiet now. Listen to this. Like what if I just wasn't here? What if I was gone? What if I was kidnapped in a, in a, in a imposter, a, a sussy imposter? took my place. You guys wouldn't even know because you can't see me. There's so many things wrong with zero webcam. Webcam should be a requirement for let's plays now. I think they're pretty cool. Epic. Hey, this is good for money equals power. This is really, really good for that. As well as getting the key piece one to fight Mega Satan, which we can now do on this run for a, f a finale for this uh, segment of videos here. And you take both of these, immediately pop your foiled stars card next floor. Brother. I don't want to say we're going to win this run, but you see an avenue where we lose. Go deep. Oh, okay. I'm going to have a nice treat from vacation back. This allows me to choose one of the items that I have to give to me at the start of my next run. Interesting. You go with Crown of Light. You go with Crown of Light. The reason for that being, we get this back immediately. I could have cut it there and rolled it, I guess, but them's the breaks, right? Um, next run, I'm gonna come back from vacation. I'm not going to think about what the last run was, and I'm just going to see Crown of Light in my starting room. Ooh, 30 coins. That's a plus 24 damage right there. All right, buddy. Uh, oh, I'm an idiot. Uh, I'm going to have an amazing start to it, and I'm going to feel so happy looking back at what I accomplished today. Dude, why is our damage so goddamn high? I'm not even going to worry about the shop. I'm just going to leave. We could potentially have like a really quick run. We're on a 14 minute depth too. I, I guess we should be faster looking at our... I shouldn't have grabbed that. I guess we're going to Mega Satan anyway. It's no big deal. Oh, no more bad pathing for me. Anything even remotely worth it in here? Absolutely not. These are all like quality one items. Keep going. This is good. This is good. I think uh, with the mind and my superior intellect that I have from just from being born perfect, uh, I don't know if we can be stopped here. This is like see the end of the season, like anime protagonist type shit. Like I, I'm just so abysmally strong. The only possible way I lose is if the show gets canceled, and I do not plan on canceling or crashing today's run. We haven't gotten a devil deal in. in Ages, brother. Uh, actually, you know what, dude? Sayonara. Oh, it only gave us the void. Are you are you yanking my Joshua right now? Buy it. Void both those for extra stats, and then take this. Uh, go down to the thing, please. I almost got hit by the goddamn altar fiend. Oh, uh, we can take a shortcut here. Actually, no, we can't, because I don't want to have to uh, go all the way around to my boss, Trevor. I, I don't want to have to play the game, is my reasoning. I just want to run, and honestly, it's probably a little bit 
quicker than doing the shortcut route because we aren't forced to clear any rooms right now. Where's the hand sad dog? Good. Oh my god, I, I wasn't even looking at you. That shouldn't count. I wasn't even looking at you. Give me a break, Eddie. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, yes? Yes? I mean, why wouldn't we go fight Hush on this run? Unless our damage stays at 40, there's no reason not to. We should go back to 70, I'm pretty sure. I think when you clear the floor, it goes back down. No, we're at 40. Okay, well, uh, hey, them's the breaks, right? Oh, hello, beautiful. I need keys, though. Why does this always happen to me? Two hearts. I wanted keys. Well, hey, man, you can't win them all, right? Diplopia is good enough for me. We don't even have the, the doubling for the items there. It's okay. Oh, you know why we don't have that much damage? Uh, we have Crown of Light. The item I was so excited for like a minute ago. We can get it back here though, just watch. Actually, we can, we can infinitely bomb farm for mega damage against this man. We're gonna spawn a bunch of troll bombs down now. Nice. Now we're back to 70 freaking damage, baby. That's what I wanted to see right there. Get a full secretion charge. Time it, time it, time it. Okay, baby. All right. This is what I wanted to come down here for. This is a solid hush fight for us. We actually got a key out of that, so we can go to one of our items, or we could gamble for more keys from the chest and hopefully get even more keys back, but uh, don't count on it. And you're dead. Hush is a goner. Yep, one, the, the freaking bomb, oh my god, the freaking bomb Grimace took him out. Now we have a guaranteed way to get uh, keys. So, strategy here is shoot and then bomb this fool, because he's going to drop you money, and that money, look at that, becomes keys. And now we have three keys. And now we're going to have even, wow, that was bad timing. Uh, going to here, Luckfoot's good. Take it. Extra luck is always good. Um, sure. Money. Yo, gotta be a key there. Look at that. One key at least. Boom. Even more money. Gotta be a key in there somewhere, right? Look at that. Two keys. We can open up everything on this floor. Things just always tend to work out. Dad's newspaper. Ooh, it's like a little forgotten bone club as a Zazel. I can't turn that down. It's Cathedral, Chest, then Mega Satan time. Clock, we're gonna might have a sub half an hour Mega Satan run. I mean, as, it's not hard to come by as a Zazel, obviously, but uh, it's still cool to see, I guess. I can run through rooms, that's right. I mean, with, with Mercurius, we should have been going fast. We didn't stop to do Hush and all that kind of stuff, but uh, I, I should try harder next time to go a bit faster, I feel like. But I guess TLDR for today, if you want to answer a question, I guess the question would be like, uh, what is, what is the, the saddest thing that's ever happened to a pet? You, that's a bad question. That might say my pet died and I feel really guilty for bringing that memory back up. Uh, what, is, what is the biggest worry with having a pet? What do you think is like the scariest thing about having a pet? I think it's just them not knowing that how much you care for them because you can't really express that in cat language. I could meow at them, but I'm not on camera. This sucks. Can I just get one key? I want to open up that last chest. What, what if it's a good Diplopia item? With 6.5 luck, though, we're probably not going to get a key drop. Uh, we're going to be getting, like, chest drops and stuff. Most likely here. I can't even hit you. Oh, well, speaking of key drops right there, thanks for that uh, perfect timing. You're gone, and you're gone. Okay, last thing here. I mean, I guess. We can join. Why is every familiar, like, okay, you know what? Don't question things, just go destroy him. Give 60, almost 69 damage. What is doubling? Oh, uh, you know what? We have, we just diplopia it. I, I, I saw double ho uh, hollowed ground earlier, and I assumed I had, like, prosperity, but we don't have prosperity. It, it just feels like everything that should not... Like, wait, why is punching bag doubled? You guys see what I mean, though? I'm not going crazy, am I? 
Why would punching bag be doubled? Good. Get him out of here. Okay, watch this. One. Newspaper roll. There we go. Okay. Not even a single tier fired from you. Maybe a sub 20 minute Mega Satan fight. Oh? And a sub half an hour video? Who could have seen this coming? Okay, slow him down. Uh, what even hit me there? I mean, I have this thing now. Well, not anymore, I don't. Uh, I don't know what's happening. I'm just going to walk in and hit him. We do plenty of damage here. It's no big deal. It really isn't. Well, uh, them's the break, kids. No delirium run here. I'm not. If we get a void, I'm not going to go for it. I'm saying it right now. See, look at that. If you enjoyed the run, though, uh, and my commentary, like and a comment goes a long way for a small channel like mine. I will see you guys in a week, my time, 24 hours, your time. It's been fun. Peace out. I'm going to enjoy my vacation. Goodbye.